Well, hello there. Today, we are making another every plate meal. Tyler is actually doing some laundry. <laughs> and before I got into the meal stuff though, I wanted to show you an update on our bathroom. If you guys saw the video where Tyler worked on caulking our bathtub, then I wanted to show you guys an update. If you haven't seen that video, we'll link it down below for you guys. But, Don't bother um, watching it, it's boring. It's not, I mean, it's boring. <laughs> it is kind of boring, but it is educational. But this part is going to be the most important part anyway. So it's an update on, um, I'm just kicking stuff over, on how it's doing. So as you guys can see, this is, you know, where our faucet is, obviously. And then it's completely peeling away from where I guess it gets the most water. And that's not good. No, it is good. <laughs> it's awesome. It's just what I wanted to do. Right, yeah. So it's um now we're gonna have to redo this. So that's unfortunate, but so we do not recommend the moral of the story is that we do not recommend that sealer. At least for a bathtub, because it doesn't work. But like you can see some white spots around the edges right here, but it's not, you know, super bad like it is over here where it didn't stick at all. So there's an update on our tub. Now that you've had an, a very exciting update on our tub, we're gonna go ahead and get into the meal that we're cooking today, which is going to be a Tuscan herbed chicken linguine. And I'm very excited about this. I think this one's gonna taste pretty darn good and it should be pretty easy to make. It looks like pretty simple ingredients and everything, pretty simple steps. So I'm hopeful that this one's gonna go well, and I'll go ahead and show you guys the ingredients. Here is the recipe card. I'm just calling it a menu for you guys. All the stuff that they give and that we have to provide, and then all of the steps. Looks like it's gonna be pretty simple. And then we've got all of our ingredients right here. One thing I will say is that all of our tomatoes have kind of come in looking a little rough. But whenever we go to Walmart, these tomatoes look rough at Walmart. So maybe these tomatoes just aren't doing well this year. I don't know. But we're going to go ahead and boil, work on boiling our pasta and work on, I guess, cutting up our garlic since that's really the only thing that we have to cut up this time. We've currently got our water in the progress of boiling. We have our garlic chopped here, our tomatoes, our lemon cut in half. I didn't show any of this because I just felt like it was unnecessary today. And now we're about to start working on step two and work on patting the chicken dry. And then we're going to toss with some olive oil and then add the garlic and half of the uh, spice that they provided. And then we'll add some salt and pepper. officially boiling we're going to add our noodles I would normally break these in half just because that's how I like to eat them but I'm not going to do that today because I feel like they should be whole so we're just going to dump them in there and hope for the best and then once again we're going to cook these until al dente which means until they're like sticky I think I don't remember but we're going to cook it like that and while our pasta is working on cooking, we're gonna go ahead and start cooking our lemons and cooking our chicken in step three. to pop in and say that I'm about to start on step four. We just completed step three, but with step four, I didn't read the instructions all the way on step one. So I chopped up all three cloves of garlic 
and didn't read the fact that I was supposed to only chop up two of them and leave one sliced. So I just had to slice up an extra garlic. So ours is going to be a little bit more garlicky, which I know Tyler won't mind. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit more garlicky now. But we're gonna go ahead and jump into step four. Here we have it. I will say this is a whole, whole lot of food, but it looks and smells delicious. So I'm really excited to eat this and see how it turns out. We just got done eating and Tyler really liked it. I thought he was, was okay. I, I don't know. I was so hopeful that it was gonna be one of my top favorites, but I don't know. It wasn't saucy enough for me. Yeah, it wasn't very saucy. I, I had some good like spice to it, which I liked. Yeah. And the Parmesan cheese on it was good. Yeah, I agree with that. I think it just like could have used garlic. more sauce. Yeah, it was too garlicky for me. I Four like cloves garlic. was way too much <laughs> for me. <laughs> it it was just, I think that's what it was, was maybe the garlic. Too garlicky. Too, uh, too garlicky. Garlicky. <laughs> no, no. Are you having a stroke? <laughs> I can't talk. Uh-huh. I'm hot and sweaty still from cooking and I can't talk. Help me. <laughs> Anyways, it was it was pretty decent. Wasn't my favorite, but wasn't as bad as the uh, melts that we had yesterday. Yeah, definitely better so, than those. So Yeah. And uh we'll see you in the next video.